Did you look up like chair squeaking sound? <laughs> no, it's the my microphone stand. Oh. Sounds like when you have you have like a straw in the top of a of a cup from like McDonald's. <laughs> like move it up and down. Like, if I had a cup around, I would demonstrate. But <clears throat> hello, everybody. And welcome. Whoa, I didn't know you were doing it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Strangers. Oh, I uh, thought you were about to say, welcome back to Stranger Things. Welcome back to Stranger Things. Speaking of uh, Stranger Things, let's talk trailers, Corgi. Hold on. Man, it's Can so hard to not say your real name sometimes. Do you know that? What are you talking about? That's my real name. Corey is my, is my real name. Yeah, I, I want to see your driver's license. <laughs> um, but uh, anyway, uh, let's talk. Let's talk trailers. Um, Hold on, I want to interject real quick and say that we're both super duper tired. So by the time we're I mean, done, I'm, we'll wake up. Yeah. So sure. Also, Jacob, I got a question for you before we start. <laughs> okay. Uh. Are you going to go to your dentist appointment, Monday? I am going to strangle you. Um, <laughs> anyway, let's talk trailers, because there was a lot of good trailers this week. Two yeah. in particular, and then there was a third one that we'll talk about as well. Um, <laughs> Wait, I'm confused. What's the what's the one we're going to talk about, but two good ones? Because I know There's two Stranger Things is a good Stranger one. Stranger Things Season 3 and Toy yeah. Story 4. And then John Wick <laughs> came out as well. Oh, but okay. We'll talk about John Wick because it, like, yeah, it's a trailer and it looks like another John Wick movie. But we'll talk about that later. Um, you, you want to talk about Toy Story first, or do you want to talk about Stranger Things first? Uh, dude, I pff, let's do Stranger Things since it comes first in the alphabet. Barely. Q R S. Yeah, you're right. Um, yeah, I know my fucking alphabet, dude. I've passed kindergarten. I, I hate. I'm proud. I don't. Uh, every time someone's like, put something in alphabetical order, I'm like, all right, A, B, and C. And then I have to go A, B, C, D, A, B, C, D, E, A, B, C, D, E, F. And like, I have to say the whole alphabet to get whatever's next because I'm. Um, but anyway. A, B, uh, Q, Z, V, W, P. Ew. Ew. Get that Z shit out of here. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys say Z. Uh, Ew. Yeah. Because, you know, letters aren't words. Um, and anyway, uh, <laughs> Strange Things Season 3. Um, so it takes place in the year 1985. Uh, probably like, you know, right after summer. Dude, that's like 34 or, years or ago. right during, well, no, it's July 4th. So, so it's like summertime. July 4th, right after summer. It's coming to you from well, you would think you would think it'd be after summer because he like the start of the trailer is. Uh, I always forget their names. I'm gonna pull up a little thing so I don't forget their names. Uh, Dustin, it's him coming back from like a summer camp, basically called Camp Nowhere. <laughs> well, where is what it says? Where's the camp located? Uh, that I don't know. Nowhere. Uh, <laughs> isn't isn't there a place called Nowhere? Is there? Wasn't there like a, there was like a bridge to, like, IRL, like real life or like in the show. Yeah, nowhere is in Oklahoma. Nowhere, Oklahoma. All you Oklahomians. In Caddo County. Wait, can we just can I can we just rename the people of Oklahoma to uh Oklahomos? N- no, uh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say Oklahomers or Oklahoma Oklahomies. That's it. The Oklahoma. Yo, like what's up? <laughs> so nowhere Oklahoma is the camp that Dustin goes to. Oh, we don't know if that's where it is, but he, he goes to a camp nowhere. Sorry, I was looking up a list that has all the names of the characters and Stranger Things, so that if I forget them, I can just ref- Um Wow, and I thought you were a true fan. I'm a pretty big fan, but it's been a hot minute since season two happened, and no one's name is mentioned 
during the uh, <laughs> during the trailer, except for the fact that Dustin's name is on the little sign that they hold. Um, but yeah, there's some there's some neat stuff uh, in the trailer. We get to see uh, we get to see people working their summer jobs. We get to see uh, the new monster, uh, that, which like, I'm very excited for. Blob thing in the school? I'm assuming it's a school. Uh, I think it was in a hospital, but uh, sure, it's a blank white hallway. It wasn't a blank white hallway. With lockers. You just didn't pay attention. There was no lockers. I swear there was... I'm going to look at it right now. Damn it. Okay. You're right. It is a fucking uh-huh. hospital. Yep. That's what I thought. <laughs> uh, sorry. Dude. I know you are a true fan. Um, <laughs> we, also, we, uh, we get to see some cool little like lookbacks at, at the past season. For example, Dustin sprays Lucas in the face with the can of hairspray. The Farrah Fawcett hairspray that he gets from Steve in season two. Um, in season two, there was a there was like a note or something that said uh, where yellow meets blue in the west or something, and then we see we see Eleven wearing a yellow shirt by the water. Maybe that's that's a reference. Who knows? Well, dude, you're you're digging deep. Are you in China? What is he? Wow. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> There's a. Uh, we also we also get to see Lucas's younger sister a lot in the trailer, and I'm interested to see if she plays like a more important role in the. Oh, that's the uh, the redhead, right? Or it's, no, the one no. in the black shirt. No, it's eleven. What the fuck? Who are you? Lucas. Uh, it's the she's the little she's the little girl with the the like flashlights on her helmet that's crawling through the air vent. That's Lucas's younger sister. Uh, sorry, I'm like I'm like skimming through. <laughs> um, hold, it's a very short thing. Hold on, hold on. Don't call a kid short, dude. They're self-conscious about that. Yeah, they know that they're still growing. And if you don't know that, they could just stop randomly. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Um. Oh, and the, did you see the um? When they're racing up that antenna thing or whatever in the field, oh, yeah, that's, it's like the that's super... band of brothers or yeah, ah, throat callbacks. Oh, and, and watching, what seeing seeing Hopper just makes me really happy. He's like one of my favorite characters. Man, seeing Hopper alone in that restaurant, it's sad. And then it shows. Um, no, no, seeing. Seeing uh, uh, Joyce in on the couch, like, like at, on the couch eating dinner with like the wine, Aww. that was sad. Man, why don't they just get together? And be, just be a couple. I mean, she's probably grieving. You know. No. Oh Spoilers. shit! I forgot dude, about Bob that whole died part. Six months ago, dude. <laughs> I forgot Samwise Gamgee. Oh my god! How did I forget Bob, he was in Bob there? Died. Six months ago, dude. Oh, fuck, man. Thanks for fucking crushing my heart a second time. I mean, hey, I would love to see Hopper and Joyce, you know, get together. They'd be cute AF. And it looks like, it, it. I think he's talking to her when he says the, like, I want you to feel safe and, like, like I want you to be able to feel like this is still your home. I think he's talking to Joyce. When he's- also, also there's a scene... Where Eleven has the little blue uh, hair tie on her wrist. Uh, and that's the blue hair tie that was in Hopper's daughter's hair. Dude, how the fuck did I just click on that scene and then you started talking about that scene? <laughs> <laughs> the one where the girl's sitting in the background, right? On the bed? Yeah, yeah. I think her name's Max, right? Max? Yeah, that's Max. Got it. Yeah, she, she like went by Mad Max in the arcade. Or- yeah, yeah. So, is Eleven living with Max then, or where? Um. Well, she she got adopted by Hopper. No, that's what I thought. But this doesn't look she, like Hopper's trailer. I mean, house. she's probably just chilling. You know, they have friends. She's a lot outdoors now. She goes to school, chilling, Max, and relaxing, all cool. Sure. Um. 
Also, there's that dude with a gun in the mirror house. Oh, that's spooky. The fun house? I wonder what that's all about. Well, I mean, there's, it's the 4th of July carnival, it looks like, because the scene before. I mean, it. yeah, but that, you, when was the last time you went to a 4th of July carnival and there was a dude with a gun in the, in the mirror house, uh, huh? Last year? Uh, last 4th of July. Yeah, uh huh. Okay. Actually, uh-huh. no, I don't, because I don't celebrate that bullshit. I heard the Penn Day was three days earlier. <laughs> I forget that the actor who plays Dustin, his name is really hard to pronounce. Uh, Gaten Mat- Mataterrazzo. Hold up, dude. G a t e n m a t a r a z z o. Cool. Gaten Mataterrazzo. Gaten Mataterrazzo. Mat Mat Mataterrazzo. Matrazzo. Oh yeah, Matara- Matarazzo. I think it's Matarazzo. Or, probably right. Or it's Matra- Matar- Matarazzo. I don't think it's Matarazzo. Ma- it's Matarazzo. Matarazzo. Oh, sorry. It's. I, I hope. I hope he does that. The current Twitter thing where he like top five misspellings of my name. <laughs> uh. Okay. Well, I'm about to break it. You ready? It's it's Gatton. Matt Tar Z Z O. Z Z O. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Wow. You're welcome. Wow. You're welcome, Gatton. Wow. Come on our podcast, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <I can> do <laughs> dude, that'd be sick, dude. His smile. Or Joe oh, Joe Kiri. Oof. If Joe Kiri wants to come on here, that'd be sick as fuck too. Uh that's Steve, by the way. Yeah. Dude, I'd love Steve. There was a huge yeah. break in there. <laughs> oh, also, you know what? Actually, if you're on Stranger Things and you want to come on our podcast, <laughs> just hit us up. I'm down. Um, also, the Zac Efron lookalike is back as a lifeguard. As... Oh, 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 yeah, the Chad. The Chad. I don't even remember his name. So Chad. Um. God, what is, is he? Name? Is he Billy? It's, it, it sounds like a Billy. Billy. Yep. Stick. Let's go. What? Well, this thing is just literally a list of names, and like half the pictures aren't even. Oh yeah, I think I was just looking at that. Oh, I love uh. I love how fucking Dustin and um, Steve had their own little, like, dance thing in the, uh... Oh, the little, like, handshake? The ice cream shop, yeah. <laughs> and then that girl's just like, so how many kids are you friends with? <laughs> That's what you, yeah. It's kind of weird, eh? That's funny. For, like, what? I don't know. Never mind, forget I said anything. No, 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 no. no fucking continue. No, 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 Jesus. No, 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 what the fuck? No, 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 no. You can't just be like, ain't that weird? Ain't it? <laughs> and expect me to like, know what the fuck you're talking about, like, the fact that Steve and Dustin are kids? Or like, friends? <laughs> Dude, it's really weird that Dustin is a fucking child. <laughs> <laughs> How dare they be like 12 years old in this show? Oh, dude, I'm excited, though. This is going to be good. I can't wait till July 4th. Yeah, it's going to be... Oh, Stranger Things is just such a good show. It is, dude. The Duffy Brothers are very good writers. Hashtag jealous. Well, I'm trying to find, like, another, like, noteworthy scene. Oh, what the fuck do you think is going on with the drowning thing? Where she's like... I think that's, that's just the upside down, dude. Oh, oh, Eleven goes back into her fucking, uh, remember in the first season when she was in that water tank and it was just blackness and shit? You mean how she would go to the Upside Down? Was that the by, Upside Down? By, by, yeah, she would have to be, like, completely soaked in water yeah. and then she could go to the Upside Down. Yeah. Okay, so that is the Upside Down. All right. Hey. And then it seems like Billy got infected with something? question mark yeah it kind of looks like they're like part of the thing this time around is this like disease because like they show 
uh, Billy's arm, and then they show a close-up of somebody's eye, and it's all, like, it's got these, like, black, veiny-looking things through it. But I think part of the... Part of the... The spoopiness is gonna be this, like, weird sickness disease thing that's going around infecting people. Hence why they're in a hospital, dude. Also, also... Also? Everybody seems really upset with the mayor. Like, the casting wise, or it right how he's written into it. Like in the show, there's a bunch of people protesting the mayor. Oh, you mean like an actual storyline? <laughs> I, I thought you meant like people bashing on the trailer for the mayor casting. I don't know, dude. Yeah, how dare that one dude <laughs> from the Princess Bride be there? Fuck him. God, fucking whitewashing. I don't know, that's what I thought that you were talking about. Yeah, his, his name is Larry Klein. Larry Klein. God, dude, that's so ugly. It's an ugly name. Played by Carrie... Line? <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce that. <laughs> E-L-W-E-S? Elwes? L L S L L L. Did you just, um, did you just like, completely ignore my joke? You asshole. <laughs> I may not have heard it. Uh, uh, the dude's name, what, what did you say the mayor's name was? Larry Klein? His, his, in the show, his name is Larry Klein, but the actor's name is Carrie Klein. Elvis. There we go. Carrie Line. Yeah. Larry Klein. Carrie Line. Larry Klein, Carrie Line. Ah, yeah, I see. let me explain now it for you. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, you uncultured fucking asshole. Damn. <laughs> All right. Well, moving on to the other. Oh, we're moving Unless on. Unless there's any other Stranger Things you wanted to talk about. I don't know. I just thought it was kind of fun how they slid down the escalator like that. I want to do that. Yeah, I'm kind of jealous. All right. Um, yeah, we can move on if you want. <laughs> All right. Uh, the Toy Story 4 trailer, though. Uh, Seems I th- a little okay. Can I can I unpopular opinion, Corgi? Uh, gross. Sure. I don't think they should have made a fourth one. Um, I kind of agree. It seems very like toys, not like versus in like a fighting way, humans, but like, hey, you're a toy, and you don't. You're a strong, independent toy man, Woody, and you don't need no who man. Okay, that's what it seems like to me. Um, I don't know. It seems. It also seems like Bo Peep's trying to manipulate Woody. I ain't no fan of that. Yeah, I feel like they really like hinted that Bo Peep is gonna be a baddie in this one, for some reason. Yeah, cause she's all like, "Make sure Woody doesn't leave." It's like, bitch. Oh, was that? I'm, kind of, I'm actually kind of tired of Everyone, bye, trailers like friends. giving away a lot of information. Oh, yeah. Nothing happens to him. Um. Hold on, I'm gonna like situation. look through the trailer real quick. Again. I am not a toy. I was made for okay. salad, maybe chili. Why the fuck is there a what? fucking spork? You know, I think they're trying to play up like kids' imaginations. A little bit, but who? Um, the fact that she puts a fucking like what are they called? Tube cleaner or whatever? Pipe cleaner <laughs> around a spork. Pipe cleaner, thank you. <laughs> around a spork and puts fucking googly eyes on it, and it's now a fucking toy that can talk with all the other toys. I kind of have a problem with that. Yeah, like can you just make anything a toy? Hey, look this uh this fucking. This thing of lotion. Oh wow, that sounds really bad being on my desk. Yeah, the lotion. I, I just, desk? I just use it for my yeah, tattoo, dude. Too. I use it for a tattoo. You fucking asshole. <laughs> 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 All right, my uh, my cell phone. Slap some googly eyes and put a fucking piece of wood for feet there. It's a toy, dude. I literally so my my NES, my Nintendo Entertainment System. It has it has these little like paper eyeballs and a cat mouth and a cat and some cat ears on it does that mean that at night when i go to sleep my nes just pops out and is all like 
<laughs> so you're trying to tell me Toy Story? Oh. Like. God. Bruh. Dude. Fix your shit. <laughs> yeah, I think they're just grasping for, like, stuff now. And. But at the same time, like, I'm still gonna go see it. Hey, look, Woody <laughs> fell out of a moving car again. Oh, yeah, that happens in every movie, though. Yeah, uh, Toy Got Lost? <laughs> okay, let's make a whole adventure about getting them back. Got a creepy fucking puppet store. Hate that, dude. Yeah, I'm not excited about it. Um, I don't know, it's... I feel like... It's a Toy Story movie. Yeah, it, exactly. And it's exactly what it is. Like Disney, had, Disney and Pixar have this issue where when they make a sequel, they just tell the same story again. Just... Same shit, with like a with a weird like, yeah, like same shit, different day, small twist. Like, and I don't know, I don't get it. I don't like. I get that maybe the writers are lacking in some creativity, but I don't understand how they get these big budgets when there are people (laughs) who have actual creativity. Um, what was the first Toy Story about again? It was Woody and. Well, it was just like the the conflict of Woody and Buzz, and then. It leads to Woody pushing Buzz out a window, and then they throw Woody out the window. <laughs> oh, yeah. And it's like payback. And then they're about to move, and Andy's freaking out because he can't find Buzz and Woody. Because they're at Sid's house, because he won them at Pizza Planet in the crane game. All right. So they have to escape and get back to Andy's house. So just replace uh, the sporky dude with Buzz, and there you go. Toy Story 1, pretty much. Except without a torturing little kid but instead instead of sid it's a bunch of other toys at this weird puppet factory oh and instead of the puppet girl put the purple teddy bear oh you're talking about you're talking about in the third movie yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. okay what was his name because like i don't know i feel like they're gonna pull that fastball again where they're like all the acting all nice and then uh at the near the end, they're like, Lotso. "Oh, we're Lotso, yeah, yeah. we're all yeah, fucking okay. evil. We want to kill you and s- enslave you forever." I feel like that's what's gonna happen with Bo Peep, but like in a carnival. It's weird because Bo Peep seems to have this like laissez-faire, very like, nah, it's just life now. Be I don't know. It's weird. She's she's talking about how kids lose toys every day look how my motherfucking kids are out there and shit like that and it's like what what does that even how does that relate like there's big efficiency having having many children in the world and then having a kid who cares about you as the toy you are to like you know properly play with you and give you the attention that i'm sure these toys need in the toy story remember how sad wheezy was at the end of Toy Story 1? Yeah. Or is that Toy Story 2? I don't know. I, I know what you're talking about. Hold on. The guy who sings You Got a Friend in Me. <laughs> uh, I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah, Toy Story 2. He's the, he's a little penguin, and Woody like rips his arm, and she puts him up on the shelf because she needs to fix him, but then he finds the penguin up there who had a broken squeaker. And, then, and he doesn't get fixed until, like, the end of the movie. Yeah. See, I don't know. I feel like Toy Story... I'm sure it'll be a good movie. Like, I literally cried in the last Toy Story movie. Didn't everyone cry in the last Toy Story movie? I don't know, actually. Oh, and... Comment down below if you cried during Toy Story 3, because I did. And Andy looks like a proper child in this one, instead of a... Andy's gone, dude. Well, who... No, they, they showed, like, a flashback of Andy. Oh, did they? Yeah, and he didn't look like a someone who had surgery on every single tooth in his face. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> you, you, dude, you know, one of my biggest gripes about Toy Story in the past was... Well, first off, they said that they made a movie about toys because they were worried about being able to animate people, uh, which is very clear by, like, the first couple movies. They really suck at animating people. Um, but they, they make all the people sleep in this really weird, uncomfortable, like knees to the chest position in the first movie and i don't understand what you don't sleep like that no i don't sleep in a with forward facing fetal position with your knees like buried straight into your chest dude that's the only way that you sleep properly to get a good no. night 
That's I why to, you I, suck at sleeping, dude. No, I have to have my legs stretched out. Otherwise, my dog doesn't know where to sleep. Right. You have a dog. I keep forgetting she, you she, have a dog. She curls, she curls up in a little ball between my shins. What's your dog's name again? Minnie. Min- Minnie? M-I-N-I. Minnie! Short for, short for Minerva. Minerva. It's so exciting. It's Professor McGonagall's first name from Harry Potter. Minerva McGonagall. Mm-hmm. I want to watch Harry Potter now. You want to watch some Harry Potter? Sure, dude. Hell yeah. Let's just get on Rabbit and watch all eight of them. All right. We'll, uh, we'll watch them. I forget that there are seven books, but eight movies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they split the last one, right? Yeah. So we'll watch uh, we'll watch all of them in one sitting. We'll do like a commentary on it, Ooh. and then we'll put it on the TV in our little podcast thing. Oh my god! <laughs> you guys ready for this? Do you think people would be interested in in us doing like commentary over movies? I don't know. I don't see why not. I mean, that's a that's something that another YouTube channel I used to watch did. They like they had a Patreon. Well, they used a Game Wisp at first, but now they use Patreon and like their patrons they would like stream watching a movie on the patron stream and they would give their like thoughts about the movies and stuff can i uh can i go off on a side path here into the bushes or something next to the weird trees sure uh do you see the changes patreon is making or the change patreon is making yeah is that you said? yeah like apparently you have to no, pay no you have to pay i mean work to begin with no, 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 no! Like you, you have to pay to be to put up a Patreon. Oh, honestly, that's kind of like I'm not. I don't have a problem with that. Like I get that they need to make you, money, right? But you shouldn't. You shouldn't make a Patreon unless you know that you're gonna have people who. Right and patron it. It doesn't seem like that big of a deal because uh, if you have like patrons, then. That'll just pay for just your even yeah. Patreon. Yeah, I mean, they're probably just trying to, like, clear up some clutter because there's probably a million Patreon pages where there's nobody p- being a patron. Yeah. Or at least, I think... So, I mean, I get it. You have to... That's what I read somewhere. Um... Alright, what's the last, uh, last trailer we're going to talk about? I think... We were talking about the John Wick trailer. John Wick, McShooty, yes. McShooty face. It's gun foo and it's uh, crotch rocket katana ninjas. <laughs> uh, I will say that it's the first movie I've seen fucking motorcycle riding, katana wielding ninjas fighting a dude who's an expert with, with guns. a gun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I like the fight that takes place in the antique knife shop. Dude! <laughs> I was... And they, like, st- they both stare at each other for, like, a hot second of, like, are you gonna break the thing? <laughs> and then the guy looks back at John Wick, like, are you gonna break the thing? And John Wick's like, I'm gonna break the thing. And then the other guy breaks the thing, and then he's like, oh, shit, now I gotta break the thing. <laughs> and by the thing, I mean the glass window, obviously. Yeah. Oh, and they just start I, throwing knives at each other, um, and only John Wick knows how to aim a knife. I was watching the trailer before we started the podcast, and it, like the one po- oh dude, fuck the guy from Game of Thrones is in here. I just realized. Uh, before I don't watch Game of Thrones. God damn it, you fucking pleb! The guy who voices Commander Zavala in <laughs> Destiny's in this movie, though. Um, sorry, continue. No, it's cool. Just interrupt me. That's fine. No, technically, you cut yourself off, you know? No, you were like, oh, the guy that voiced fucking Commander Tits, Titsvana. Zavala. Zavala. But you were like, oh, yeah, we were, I was watching the thing before we started the podcast, and then you were like, oh, the dude from Game of Thrones is You literally cut yourself off. What are you talking about? <laughs> uh, you don't know I was talking to you when I said, don't interrupt me, you fucking asshole. I was talking to myself. <laughs> talking to myself. Um... No, I was watching this before we started the podcast, and there's just a scene where John Wick just kept throwing, like, knives at this dude. Just, the dude kept moving. There's, like, six knives in him. How's he still going? Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck, dude. Well, they're very un... He, they weren't vital places. They, they were, were like, chest. all in his... 
It they were in a stomach. Fucking, okay, you want to move around with a fucking pierced intestine? Look, you could throw four knives in my stomach, and I could probably still move around a little bit. Not for very long. I was going to say something, but I'm not going to. Do it. I right. dare you to throw four knives in my stomach. No, I was going to say you got some extra padding, though, so it's like it's not fair. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> This kitty, I love you. Oh, don't leave. <laughs> wow. wow. What you said, do it. Wow. No, it's cool. It's whatever. Uh, uh, well, I don't know. It looks pretty good, dude. I'm I, like. <laughs> I mean, the John Wick movies have always it's... been really good. Like. I've never watched a John Wick movie and walked away like, man, that was a waste of a couple hours. I'm always like, damn, that movie was good. Yeah, like, it's, they know how to make a good action movie, but I feel like it's just another yeah, yeah. John Wick movie, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. like, definitely. Like, they, there's never been a good storyline to John Wick. It's just a really good action movie. Like, I don't know. She even says, like, this is all over a puppy or whatever in the trailer. <laughs> uh, meta. Hold on. Uh, Speaking of things that are meta, can I off topic about Apex Legends really quick? Uh, sure. <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> sorry. Corgi just sent me a funny picture. Um, about John Wick. Um, speaking of meta, uh, did you know that if you're playing Mirage in Apex Legends and both your teammates leave the game, he has unique dialogue? <laughs> oh, really? What does it... Yeah. Um, so when it's like 30 seconds out, rings closing or whatever, he'll be like, he'll, he'll be like, oh, rings moving. And I'm talking to myself again. <laughs> It's really funny. God damn it, dude. I love that game. It's a good game. There's a... I can't believe people have already like, it's dead! Yeah. <laughs> what? Apex Legends? Like it's been out for less than two months yeah. and they already gave us a season pass. What are you talking about? Do you know how long it's been, how long it took uh, Epic to bring out a season pass for Fortnite? It's an... I don't know, actually, but I, I didn't even get into Fortnite. <laughs> Until, like, season four or five. When they got the John Wick skin. Right. Hey, look. Look, it all came back around. It all comes full circle. Wow. Again, like the old days. God. Just the Dude, I... Nothing's I want his suit, what? though. John Wick suit. Where it's just a it's bulletproof. Just black on black on black. No, bulletproof. Oh. The... the... Bulletproof. Sorry. No, you're good. Keep singing. It's what it just keep singing. Sing the whole song. Sing like five whole songs. Bohemian Rhapsody. Go. Mama! Just kill the man. That's not how the song starts, though. Oh, shit. Um, is this the real life? Right. Is this is just this fantasy? Call it a and no escape from reality. Anyway, that's not what our podcast is about. Open oh, your uh, eyes! Look up to the skies and see. I'm just a poor boy. Have you ever just... I need to say... I'm sorry. <laughs> because it's easy. Anyway. Uh... <laughs> Have you ever just, like, looked up a song and then, like, not seen the lyrics, but just say it in, like, just regular? I I actually thought about starting a YouTube channel where I, I, I just do that. Really? Uh, <laughs> like, I, I play the song in the background with no lyrics, and then it, it it's, it's like a cover song, but then I just, like, when I was a young boy, my father took me into the city. To see a marching band, he said, son, when you grow up, would you be the savior of the broken, the beaten, and the damned? What the fuck are you talking about, dad? No, I don't want to be that. That sounds terrible. He said, will you? No, I just... Defeat them. No. Your demons and all the non-believers. 
De demons? Are they in my closet? Are they under my bed? Can you check that? The plans that they have made. The, the demons made. What the fuck? Because are you talking one about? day, I'll leave you. A phantom. You're gonna go to leave you in the summer. This is like the time you went to get cigarettes to and everything. Join the black parade. I'm gonna. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna like uh, just um, read off some script here real quick. Please excuse me. All right. <coughs> Uh, uh. Mylene costs more than your rent. Oh, your mama still live in a tent. Yeah. Still sleeping dope in the jets? Huh? Me and my grandma take meds. Oh. None of this shit be new to me. Fucking my teacher? Call it... Tutory? Bought some red bottoms, cost hella G's. Uh, fuck your airline, fuck your company. Bitch, your breath smell like some cigarettes. I'd rather fuck a bitch from the projects. They kicked me out of the plane off of Par- Par- The fuck? I didn't even know this guy could say that word. Now Lil Pump, fly a private jet. Gucci gang. 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 Parentheses Gucci Gang. <laughs> oh, the page flip to just say Gucci Gang again actually killed me. Uh, it, it, if you don't mind, one second. I, I do have uh, a reading to do as well. Oh, of course. Certainly, um, certainly sir. Go ahead. Yes. Uh, oh, wait. One more page. Uh, cities breaking down on a camel's back. They just have to go because they don't know why. So while you fill the streets, it's appealing to see. You won't get uncounted, because you're damned and free. You got a new horizon. Oh, I don't even know how to pronounce that word, I forget. <laughs> <laughs> Ephemeral? What the fuck? <laughs> Eph Ephemeral. What the f fuck, you gorillas? Speak English, guys. Ephemeral? Anyway. Ephemeral? Uh, lasting for a very short time. Oh, it's like you in bed. <laughs> you don't know that shit, dude. You never see me. still dying i didn't even hear what you said <laughs> is there anything else we wanted to talk about was, since was, it's just <laughs> reading song here i was just about to ask that uh i, I don't know I, I don't think i don't have anything else to talk about we've been going on for a strong uh 40 minutes hey that's pretty good so you know how kesha is spelled with a dollar sign yeah k dollar sign huh if she went to europe would it be a pound sign? Over the E? It'd be a euro. A uh, euro? Sorry. Whatever the... It'd be K euro Shaw. 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 Now it's... Now it's... Now it's K dollar sign Ha. But there it'd be K euro Shaw. K euro Shaw. <laughs> K euro Shaw. <laughs> Kirosha. Have you guys listened to <laughs> Kirosha? She's this hot new singer-songwriter in the hip-hop industry. All right, everybody. Uh, thank you for <laughs> tuning into the podcast. The music, outro music, should be popping on soon, hopefully. And if it's not, punch me in the face. Cause Damn. I don't know. Boom. Apologize that it's so short. Boom. Just like my time in 45 bed. 45 minutes is a bit... Is a bit. That's that's pretty good. It's only forty three minutes and fucking. Oh yeah. Well, I guess we could talk for two more fucking minutes. Right. 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 No, we can't talk for two minutes. I already said mute's coming on. Oh, well, it's probably over right now. I didn't write very long song. <laughs> <laughs>